Here is a video that uh, some of you might find extremely useful and others might just find overly top awesome, I have to admit. But a lot of people have never thought about how many bathrooms you can put in your home. And um, according to some of these building code books and some of the reference uh, information I got on the internet, if you have a three inch drain line, you can only have three um, toilets, not three bathrooms, three toilets. So if you have two, a house with two bathrooms in it and two toilets, you can always add a third one. And if you have one bathroom in your house with a three inch line, you can always add two more. Now, what exactly is a three inch drain line? This would be the drain line that all of your waste from your toilets, sinks, um, bathtub, showers, kitchen sink, washer and dryer, all of it goes down. Now, you are allowed to have, they have a thing called um, fixture units. And it's a, it's a unit of measurement for a waste line. And often a toilet is going to be about three units a sink might be between one or two, a bathtub and a shower is usually two. So if you can imagine, basically for a bathroom with a toilet, a sink and a bathtub, that would be a between five and six unit fixtures. Now you're allowed to have, in most cases, 35 unit fixtures on a three inch line. And so you're thinking, well, wait, wait a minute, I could put four or five bathrooms in here. Well, they don't always allow that. Um, and again, you need to check with your local building department to verify the information in this video. I mean, if it's one thing I can't stand, and for those of you who have been watching my channel for a long time, you know that uh, I don't want to provide information that uh, is false. And so if I don't throw that in there and you go down to your local building department and you say, hey, wait a minute, this guy said this. No, go down to your local building department, ask them, how many toilets you can put on a three inch line. If they say four or five, you're good to go. If not, then uh, the information in this video is probably going to apply to most building departments, at least uh, most building departments that use the international building um, code, international plumbing code, and um, a couple of the other code books that I checked out while making the video. Something else I noticed, but I only, I only found this mentions once, and that was the fact that it said if you have a toilet that is draining into the main line and uh, it's less than 15 feet apart, then you might need a four inch line. Now get this, the four inch line, three inch line has about 35 fixture units. A four inch line goes up to about 216. It's nuts. If you have six units on, um, uh, if you're allowed six units per bathroom on a four inch line, then I'm guessing that's around 30 bathrooms you can put on a um, four inch line. So that really makes a big difference between a four inch and a three inch line. So that's about it for the video here. Three toilets for a three inch line, not difficult to remember. Um, and again, always check with your local building department to verify any information you see on the internet. Um, I've really, um, some of these people are getting carried away. I've got to say, it is nuts so what I'm seeing out there as far as something that might work, um, something that uh, won't work, and something that you better never even think about doing. So that's it for this video. If you learned something, hit the thumbs up button. And if you knew this already, then um, why in the heck are you still watching this?